well hello there and welcome to another training nugget in this video i will be showing you on how to set up a scheduled maintenance in odoo let's get started well the first thing you'd want to have is to make sure that you have your maintenance module installed and activated you can also navigate into the application section and install the maintenance module well, setting up a maintenance calendar means that you'll be notifying every other user in your organization that you're doing maintenance that has been scheduled. To set that up, I'll navigate into my maintenance option. And on the interface, I will select maintenance and select maintenance calendar. This is where I'll schedule all the different maintenance values that will be communicated to all the team members in my organization. If I want to set my maintenance calendar to be on Wednesday 22nd at 10, I select that cell and select that as a subject and maybe type um, stop ticking, uh, select edit to make sure that it pops up on a big window. Then it asks me what kind of maintenance this is. It could be corrective or preventative. So I'll just select preventative. The priority needs to be extremely high. It will take two hours, but in case you feel it should not be taking two hours, then you can edit these two hours into the number of hours this um, scheduled maintenance is going to take. You can also tag the person who's responsible with the maintenance if it means IT or if it means uh, stock manager, then this is where you state who is that responsible person. You can also type in the description, which entails the details around the title stock taking as a maintenance mechanism by typing in the description so that your colleagues can see the need for that maintenance that has been scheduled in here. So um, I'll just put in stop checking in the description. Um, definitely down there we'll have uh, send a message, which means immediately I click on send a message. It is going to send a message to all the persons in my organization that we are going to be taking stock within that particular period of time. So I can add and of course remove other people who are not supposed to be following in my stock taking. I can save that manually. So navigating at the top, we can see this is a, a new request. You can have it as in progress so that anybody um, interacting with this will know that this request is in progress. And once it is repaired, we can also change that into uh, this aspect has been repaired. And then we can scrap it off and say we don't really, uh, we're not really interacting with this. Uh, scheduled maintenance. Remember there are other configurations that you can have in your maintenance including maintenance requests. Uh, either you're working with equipment or you are doing reporting maintenance and all these come embedded within the maintenance module in Odoo. Hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in next nugget.